Assalamu alaikum. My name is Rita and this is my best friend Linda. So Linda thinks there's no God like some people. So I'm going to ask her some questions to actually make her actually believe there is a God. So Linda, if there's no God, who created us Linda? Who created us? Who made us? And who, who took his hard work? Who took their hard work making us? Hey Linda, is it only your mum and dad? Do you think it's just your mum and dad? Maybe it's something even more special than that. Maybe it actually is God. Maybe God is actually real. It, c it could be true. Because if there was no God, that means we'll be, on, we'll be on our own and no one will be making us and it's going to be really weird. Like if there's no God, who created us, who made us, who had all these things. Mm. Isn't it God? If there was a God, you'd simply say, God did, right? So actually, there might be a God. God. You still don't, um, you still don't believe there's a God? Okay, I'll ask you something else. Then, who protected us, Linda? Who protected us? If you get hurt on the ground, it's not, who, who made you, who made you like better? And sometimes there's some accidents, some people survive in them. Who made those persons survive? Maybe it can be a child, it can be an adult that survives. But who made them survive, Linda? If there was a God, like, like there is, but you don't believe it, wouldn't there, wouldn't there like, if it, wouldn't the God, yeah, think, no, I don't want you to die, so I'm gonna survive, I'm gonna make you survive. Wouldn't that be true, Linda? You still don't believe? Okay, let's talk about another statement. Then, who made us die? Of course you would say accidents, shotguns, etc. But, some people actually die when they're just walking on the ground. They can just walk and die. Who made them die? Who made them die? Like, why are they dying? Who made them die? Why? Why did they die? Why did they just, like, die right there? Is it any, like, is there any disease? Is there anything? It's just an ordinary guy, just dead. How? How is that po even possible? Well, if there was a bot, like there is, but you still, don't, you still don't believe it, wouldn't he think it's the end of the test today? A life is like the test, and he thinks it's the end of the test. So you die. Isn't that true? You still? How long should I tell you about it? Then let's think of another statement. If there was no God, what happens after death? Like, we're just walking, yeah? And then we die? And then we'll just die there forever. Then if we all die, what's going to happen to us? What's going to happen? Are you going to actually open your eyes again? Are you going to do anything? Are you going to... Like, is there gonna be like, a t like, like I said, if there's if life is a test, then would there be like someone telling you if you got things right, if you get things wrong in your life? Of course, that must be good. That has to be good. Like Allah is the only one that can, the only one that could judge us for our life. You got a question? What is it? Good point, Linda. What is our purpose in life? Well, Linda, if you would have believed me the whole time, our purpose is to actually, you know, make things, do right choices. Do, think of you like, hmm, I'm going to do the right choice, not the bad choice. And you're going to do the right choice. It's like a test. The life is like a test. But instead of papers and pencils, it's a test of the sea. Are you actually responsible? Are you actually not good? I'm not, I don't think you're actually well, not, 